Hey guys, our fan today I gotta read a pirate treasure. We gotta do the, the next book. It was a perfect day for adventure. Nigua decided to be a pirate. R, she said, I'm Captain Nigua. She drew a big pirate flag in the sandbox. Wow. I'm Captain Austin with a hook for a hand. Austin announced he showed Nigua his hook. Two pirates are better than one, said Nigua. Let's hunt for treasure together. I have half of a treasure map, made these. Our captain understood, answered. Let's go. Pirates, Pavel said, pointing to the sand. Pirates were here. Can be can we be pirates too? asked Tyro. I'll be Captain Tyro with it one ear. R said Pavel. And I'm Captain Pablo with a peg leg. The two new pirates sailed in the ship across the ocean. R, I see the other ship, Tyro called. Let's raid it. That, that's what Scurry's pirates do. Pablo and Tyro climbed aboard the other ship and bumped it right into Captain Igua and Captain Austin. R, said Pablo. Time to walk to the plane. Hey, that sounds like fun," said Iqua. She and also jumped into the plank with a laugh. Iqua and also walk off the plank, but they did splash into water. They landed into soft, soft sand. It's a desert island," said Iqua. Just like an hour half of the treasure map. We have the have the treasure map too. Kotaro, that gave us an idea. Maybe we should be a big one band of pirates. Put their halves of the mouth together, said Austin. They put the two halves of the mouth together, and then they had a whole map. Look, Iko said, pointing that X marks the spot where. The treasure is buried. The four pirates followed the map. They walked and walked. Finally, they came to the bubbly, sticky mud pit. It looks a little far to jump, said Austin. I think I see it away, said Iqua. We can walk across that the tree. But I have a little pegged little pirate," said Pablo. Bouncing is it going to be tricky? Pablo took a small step, then another, then another. He was almost there, but then he started to wobble. Pablo was going to fall. Arch your tyro. Hey, can Cody go sleep at? You can do it. The three other pirates rushed over. They pulled Pablo to safety. Okay, it's time on me now. Oh, thanks, guys. Pablo said, Oh, no problem, said the pirates. The map says the, the X was nearby. I found an X. I, I mean, I found a V, said Pablo. This was a W, called Austin. R over here, said Igua. I found the X. They each took a turn to dig. Suddenly, Igua hit something very hard. It's a treasure chest, she called. They pulled it out up to the ground and opened the lid. <laughs> it's, a, it's the biggest diamond ever. As Pa said, it's the biggest diamond ever, said Pablo. All in the flavor of chariot, said R, said Igua. R, cheered the pirates. But first, let's bury here, said Igua, so that other pirates can steal it. We can use the map to fire later, said Tyro. Let's mark the spot with the Y. No one will never think... For looking for a Y, Faye quickly 
buried the treasure. When the treasure was buried, the pirate stood and admired the work. All this pirate was. All this pirate had made me hungry," said Nigua. "All this flavor of snack says R R to your problem on the entire road." So the pirates headed home for a snack. We're finished for the part two. Now here comes the part three. Thanks for watching.